Hi, welcome to Wise Guides. Patterns make math easy. This session is talking about pattern of square of numbers. Let's find what is the pattern when the number is square. First of all, let's say talk about the single digit. One square you call the word. Two square you call four. Three square you call nine because square means multiply itself twice. So four square you call four times four is sixteen. Five square is five times five you call twenty five. Six square you call thirty six. 7 square you call 49, 8 square you call 64, 9 square you call 81, 10 square you call 100. From the digit, we check the last digit. This one, 5 square is 25. The last digit is 5. This is a very important pattern. 5 squared 25. Number less than 5 is 4. 4 squared is 16, last digit is 6. And uh, number greater than 5, which is 6. And 6 squared is 36. See? The last digit, same. 4 squared is 16, 6 squared is 36. The last, si the last digit both are 6. Yeah. See? <coughs> and uh, 3 squared you call 9. Only one digit. 9. And the 7 squared you call 49. The last digit also 9. See? Same. And 2 squared you call the 4. Single digit. 8 squared equals 64, 4, also 4, see? And 1 squared equals 1, and 9 squared 81, last digit is 1, see? Yeah, we just uh, now is digging up patterns, number, right? See, this is a very important pattern. <coughs> and also we can find, let's say, 4 squared equals 16, last digit is 6. 6 squared is 36, last digit is 6. What is 4 and 6 related? 4 plus 6 equals 10, right? And 3 squared equals 9. 7 squared 49, also last digit is 9. And what the relation with 3 and the 7, they add together equal 10. And the 2 squared equal 4, 8 squared equal 64, and both with the last digit is 4, and 2 plus 8 equal 10. See? And also 9 squared is 81, 1 squared is 1, and the 1 plus 9 equal 10. See? Very interesting. This gave us very important pattern later on. Use this pattern, we can find the perfect square root. This is the uh, the other video, but talking about the pattern of square of number, single digit, they have this pattern. So that's easy for you to say, okay, if you say 7 squared is 49, which number square last digit also 9, say 7 make 10 is 3, see? For example, it say 8 squared is 64, last digit 4, which number make square is 4? 8 per 2 equals 4, All right? So you, you know one, you can predict, uh, you, you can get another one.
for example, one squared equals one, which number after squared, the last digit also one, one is nine, one plus nine equals ten. That's why this one. This is very useful. The first, uh, the second one, the second one I introduce you two digit. We keep going this situation. So the first uh, pattern, the second pattern, say, what about 11 square? If you use a calculate, you can see 11 square is 121, right? Last digit, 121. I say 12 square equals 144. And 13 square equals 169. Using these three, you find what the pattern when you square the number makes so easy. I say one square when you do square number two digit, square each digit. One square is one. This square, one square, also one, but you need to write because this is this is a one digit. This is ten digit because. This one square actually is 10 square, which is 100. This one is single digit, one digit. That's what one square called one. So that's why we need to write. This is the first write. 11 square is one. One square is one. This one square is zero one, right? Then what the two come from? Two is multiply. 2 multiply 1 multiply 1. You multiply these two, multiply 1 by 1 is 1 and multiply 2. Actually, they multiply these three numbers. Multiply these three numbers, you got a 2. This 2, you put the middle. This one, you need to put a 0. So the middle is 121. See, 121 here. Right? And what about 12 squared? The first digit square is 1. The last digit square is 0, 4. And multiply these three numbers because this is a 1. So multiply 2 multiply 1 is still 2. So for square 2 digit number, if first digit is 1, you don't worry. Just multiply these two is 4. Put the middle, 144. And 1 square is 1. 3 square is 9, so 109. Oh, 109, oh, this is 109. Oh, 1 square is 1, 3 square is 9, is 0, 9. And then multiply these two, 6. 169. What about 14 square? Say 1 square is 1, 4 square is 16, right? 4 square is 16. Then multiply these two numbers. 2 multiply 4 is 8. Plus 8 equals 9. 15 square equals this one you need to be careful because 2 multiply 4 equals 8. 2 multiply 3 equals 6. 2 multiply 2 equals 4. 2 multiply 1 equals 2. All this one less than 10 when add the, the middle digit is 10. Is less than 10. But this one, you can see, you say this is a 1, 1 square equal 1, 5 square equal 25, then 2 multiplied 5 is 10, right? So that's why this 10 you need to add here. So that's why you got 225. And 16 square equals 2. Because as we know, 6 square, last digit is 6, right? So this is a 1 square equals 1, 6 square is 36, and 2 multiplied 6 12, so that's why 256. So after the number greater than, after the number greater than 5, you just need to add 1 to the first digit. Let's say 17 square equals, because 1 square equals 1, 
7 squared equals 49, but because after number greater than 5, you need to add one more. So you got, actually, you got 249, and 2 times 7 is 14. We already add 1, and the 4 is here. So 289. 18 square equals, let's say this one, if you have still using this pattern. So 1 square is 1, 8 square is 64, 2 multiplied 8 equals 16, you got the 324. 19 square equals, 1 square equals 1, 9 squared is 81, then 2 times 9 is 18, see, you got 361. So, when you square the number is greater than 10, it's 2 digit, even 3 digit, but here I just introduced 2 digit. If you practice, you feel a comfortable, Two digits, then you can move to three digits. Okay, two digits just a square first number, square the second number, and then plus multiply these three numbers. Okay, let's practice uh, some question. Let's say third one. If you have number, let's say uh, thirty, you go. 36 square. First, uh, square 3 is 9, square 6 is 36, then plus multiply these three number. 2 multiply 3 is 6, 6 minus 6 is 36, right? See? This is equal to 1296. And we have Another one, let's say 45 square. 45 square, actually I can write very fast. 20, 25. Because any number square is 5. Remember, in uh, multiply two digit number very quickly that video you can see 45 square equal 45 multiply 45 because four for the first digit same the last digit four five five they add together equal ten that's why you only got four times five one more times five is twenty and the five times five is twenty five right if you the the pattern this video we learned also we say 45 square is 4 times 4 4 square is 16 5 square is 25 then multiply these three numbers because 2 multiply 5 make 10 and multiply this is 40 right so you, you have this one is 40 here that's why you got 20 25 And one more question. Let's say make bigger. 79 square. 7 square is 49. 9 square is 81. Multiply these three numbers. It say 2 multiply 7 is 14. 14 multiply 9 is 126. So you plus this one is 126. 126. You got 1426, right? So some people may say, oh, I just do this one. I just use 80 minus 1. Yeah, you can do 80 minus 1. Also, same thing. If you do, yeah, this is a, another pattern, right? But we use this pattern, we can say 4. 7 square is 49, 9 square 81, and this is always for 0, right? And then you have multiply these three numbers, 2 multiply 7 is 
14, 14 multiplied by 9 is 6, 3 is 126, so 126. And this one equal to that number. Right? So, this is the pattern of square. Thank you for watching. It's presented by Wise Guy.